Hey you guys, I am laughing because I just almost dropped this huge box. I am so excited, look at how big of a box we're opening today. This is Deco Crated, a home decor box. I am so pumped. Uh, but hi, welcome, happy Friday. I hope you guys are all great. All my new and my old friends. If you guys are new here, my name is Kitty and I love subscription boxes. Uh, and I've also been working on improving our channel. Uh, we still have a survey up if you guys don't mind. I would really appreciate your time if you filled it out and gave some constructive feedback on how I can improve and make our channel even better. Uh, but I've also been working on myself and I kind of had a big like revelation or like, I don't know, some of my like things I'm trying to learn and I'm better or finally falling into place I think. So I thought I would share something that happened to me today and maybe it could help your day be a little brighter. <laughs> so let me just move this box up right next to me. Ooh. So after a little story, I'll tell you more about Deco Creative. We'll get unboxing and then we're going to have a new little feature on our channel, uh, which we will do. I'll explain that later. Uh, and we'll do some housekeeping. I'll let you know about the upcoming lives, all of that. But how about we talk about my morning or I guess afternoon. So <laughs> today I uh, woke up and I overslept, which is nothing really new, but Again, I'm trying to better myself, better our channel, and right away I was like, oh my god, my video is going to be late, everyone's going to be mad at me, I suck, blah, 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 like just getting into that negative mindset, and once I get into that negative mindset, I freaking spiral, and it just brings about negative events, it just gets out of control, um, and I'm trying to not do that, so um, I recognize this, which is a huge first step, I recognize that I was about to go down that path and I took a deep breath and then I took a shower. Normally I go and like feed the cats first and stuff because you know how it is if you have pets. <laughs> like they act like they're on like a seven day hunger strike if you don't feed them right away. But um, yeah, so I went in the shower and I realized like that is my way to calm my mind. Like I mentioned before I have the best ideas in the shower, um, but I like think of the shower as like washing away my negativity. Like and it helps. Like in no time I was like already thinking about other things like today, ideas. <laughs> Uh, and I was doing just fine. So uh, after that, I went to go feed the cats. Now they want to go outside. Try not to let Archer outside. Archer, hold on, please. <laughs> so I went to deal with that, uh, that little cute guy over there, uh, and fed them. And I went to get like a drink, or I don't know what I was doing, but I opened up the refrigerator and I saw, I was so excited, I forgot. I had like an almost full container of chipotle guacamole and it was like perfectly green. It didn't brown overnight. It was just like, oh my, calling my name. It's like getting in my belly. So I went and I grabbed it and my sleepy little fingers dropped it. <laughs> it was like slow motion, like no, and it like fell to the ground and the cap flew off across the room and it bounced and then it bounced another time and hit the ground and none of my guacamole spilled. I know for a fact, like, from, like, dropping it before, like, that exact item um, and other things, like, because it wasn't, like, a fresh one. Like, I had a few bites. So it was, like, a little bit loose, the guacamole, you know? Uh, it usually comes out a little bit. Um, but I know if I was in that negative mindset, that guacamole probably would have fallen out, and then I would have just been more negative. I would have been pouting, like, keeping my head down, like, blaming the whole day. Like, oh, everything went downhill once the guacamole spilled. I really wanted that damn guacamole. I love guacamole. Why can't I have more guacamole? And then, you know, I think some minor little could just lead to like, you know, me pouting and being slower and this video being up even later. And then, you know, it seems minor stuff, but like that negative mindset just seriously can get you. Um, it's hard to get out of sometimes, but uh, it didn't happen this time. And I was super excited. Uh, and like I said, if I didn't, <laughs> if it did spill, I'm sure I would have, or if I was in that negative mindset, it wouldn't have happened that way. And I would have just kept my head down, pouted, gone about my day. But uh, since I didn't do that, I stood up, you know, my head up. I was really excited. I was like, I can't believe it didn't spill. And then, behold, I saw in the fridge that hidden behind that guacamole was some motherfucking queso. Like, so I could have changed my mindset. That's the whole point of the story. <laughs> I was like so much better in my head when I was thinking about it, but like even if I did go down that negative pathway, like I could have just changed my thought process again. Like take some deep breaths, done whatever I had to do. Like maybe you listen to a song I really like, like whatever um, helps you out. You know, like me showers. I probably wouldn't have showered again, but uh, not that quickly. <laughs> but you know, I could have just taken a deep breath, looked up and 
saw, instead of being my pouty self, I could have opened my eyes, positive light, and saw I got something even better. So uh, the point is like changing your mindset could really change your day and just change everything, but it's really hard sometimes and it's okay to mess up. So if you do mess up and maybe it's not even mindset, like you maybe you like are quitting smoking and you mess up once, it's okay. You can fall back on your feet. You can start over again and maybe you'll get even something better uh, or at least something you know, that you need. Like my parents used to quote or, or sing to me this one song, like, uh, you can't buy the stones. You can't always get what you want. But if you try sometimes, you might just find you get what you need. So yeah, uh, I hope that came out and made any sense. But when I was thinking about it today, when I was doing my makeup, I'm like, oh my God, like I read like self-help stuff a lot. And like some of the analogies don't make sense to me. But I'm like, guacamole, motherfucking queso. <laughs> Like, you know, like just opening your mind to the minor thing. This is such a little thing, but it could lead to a better day at least, even a better hour of your life. So uh, try and remain positive. Find something that works for you. Uh, like I guess um, for me, it's a shower. <laughs> it really works for me. I've heard other people say that about showers or baths. Uh, but yeah, you can listen to your favorite song, watch YouTube, whatever. Just take a few minutes to focus on that, and it could change your whole day. Even if it makes you a little bit more late, it works. Uh, yeah. So, uh, who would have thought so be, <laughs> this little guy right here would make my day so much better. <laughs> oh, and you want to know what the best thing is too? I have another guacamole too and the case is still left. So like winning and I got the great box to open today. I'm so excited. So let's get into it. Uh, so decorated. I've never opened this box. So new box alert. I'm so excited. It's a seasonal box. It's huge in bright and yellow, yellow, like color of happiness. And you get six to eight home decor items quarterly. So I do have a link in code with Decorated. So you normally pay $79.99 per season. And it's a lot, but you get a lot in here. Like and home decor is really expensive. If you guys have noticed, I've been really into it, you know, like, like more so like cleaning, um, but I'll be moving soon. So this is really exciting. I am going to get to this like style these pieces in two different places. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I've been looking into decor and stuff too, and it can be expensive. Like anything with a home seems expensive, right? So um, it actually is a great deal, but we'll have to see what's inside. I still don't know everything. I saw like one or two spoilers. Uh, so you can pay $299 for annual and you'll save $20, but I have a code. So the codes are different for the quarterly and the annual subscription plans. So um, again, everything will be down in the description box along with timestamps. I should have said that earlier in case you didn't want to hear my little like Chipotle story that was told terribly probably. <laughs> um, so you can save $15 in my code on the uh, quarterly subscription box and $20 on the annual. So you already save $20 when you subscribe annually, but you can save $40 if you wish. And the boxes are shipping now, summer boxes, and I'm so excited. They have something like that you can add on a box too if you want. So you can get even more and they have like a members only store so you can get stuff at a discount, uh, more decor stuff. So if you love their style, it's great. And their decor is supposed to fit into a bunch of different like styles of decorating. Like I don't have a specific style for anything. I just like what I like, but um, if you're worried about that, uh, you can look and see. Well, we're gonna look and see what it, there is today. So you can style it different ways. Like home decor is so cool with that. And they have uh, so cool as in you can make something like you can have the same item but make it work and look so different uh in your space but they also have three different facebook communities so you can get like some tips and they make it so that no one's like spamming you with codes they're not allowed so it's just real subscribers sharing uh how they style their items and there's a marketplace too so you could like sell and exchange items so super cool Love that there's a community i think that's everything can we get into this box i'm so excited i was going to open it ahead of time to like uh just for ease of filming and stuff. But then I saw this, like how cute is this box? Oh, sorry, it's a little shiny. But it says, welcome to summertime. It's summer and the memories are just waiting to happen with mustard yellows and classic blues. Be ready to celebrate the season that's all about fun in the sun. Uh, and I love this part. It says, oh, how exciting. Open it, open it, open it. And that's what it says here. I'm like, oh my God, I want that to be like by chant when I'm opening boxes like, yeah. Oh my god, I'm sorry, I'm really excited. Like, open it, you okay? Get that box open. And my cats have been loving this box, like closed. Can you imagine when this is empty, it's gonna stay. Because it's yellow and cute, it's also. Oh, and right on top. Oh, and it's so cute. So 
Let's see. Oh no, I forgot to charge my battery. We're gonna keep trucking. I'm not gonna let that goes down. I don't know why I'd be done. I didn't. So there is an exclusive code for decorators. Uh, oh, so you can get 15% off your decorators. Nice. How cute. <laughs> And on the back, it says, I love you like bees love honey. I think these colors are so cute. And by the way, I heard your feedback. I'm going to try and hold things um, closer. We all turned on a light now. I love my new dress, by the way. eBay. It might be a lot darker, but I think this will be better for you. I think this is so cute. I love the colors. And then welcome to summertime. Oh, and they tell you like the artist thoughts and the color palette, the key themes and combining elements. So finishings and textiles. Ooh, this is so exciting. The color palette. I love the color palette. It's like blues and yellows. Like, yes. I never even think about that stuff when I'm decorating and but now I'm, I'm getting into new things all the time I'm excited <laughs> I'm thirsty too sorry if I it's obvious so summer days are here and you better believe it it's going to be sensational greet the season with a celebration of citrus yellows and cool blues that evoke the spirit of summer oh you guys be nice to each other please I don't think I really gave him much attention today because I was so focused on doing this video I was so excited <laughs> um, accent your home with pairings of seasonal icon iconic the possibilities are endless, just like summer. <laughs> and then they show you uh, who the DECA creators are. They're a group of talented women. Love that. They work with a product development team to combine illustrative trends with home decor. <gasps> and it shows you the pieces. So this is one of them. It's considered like the art piece. So It's so cute. You can frame this. And they show you ways to style. And tell you a little bit more about it. I love this. Oh my god, even their pamphlet is so pretty. Or like magazine. So they show it like in a kitchen. Oh my god, all different spaces. I love that. It's double sided, so there are a bunch of possibilities. I'm so excited. And everything is packaged. Some are empty, but just to make sure it comes. Oh my god, and the empty compartments. Like everything is cute. How is the cardboard even cute? I'll show you. Did I show you enough? Long enough? There's plants on it, sun, the camera. And I love that they say that their box is made from recycled material and recycle today for a better tomorrow. Okay, we are back. I opened all the boxes and I have stuff right on my little table. Can you say I styled my table? <laughs> I wish I could have spent more time. I started to do stuff. I was like, no, film. Uh, so making progress, recognizing my, my focus issues. But anyways, let's go in order of what's in here. So the next item they have is the lumber pillow. It's double-sided, so you can style it in two different ways. I don't know why I'm showing you this instead of the actual pillow. So I need to go find a pillow that fits in it or order one, but this is so cute. I was just saying, I think it was in my Fit Fun video, I love lemon prints, I love blues and greens, and look, there's bees on it. Oh my God, I love this. I think this is my favorite side, but I love this side too. Both are beautiful. <laughs> I love this so much. So, yeah, I even if I just got like this, it'd be <laughs> I love it. Oh my god, I'm just gonna place it right here for now. Can you see it? We'll make it so you can see it. Maybe. <laughs> so they show it styled on a couch and on a chair, which I kind of already showed you. I'm sorry, these laminated pages sometimes. Is that what you would say? Laminated? Mm -hmm. I like had a throwback to like third grade or sixth grade, like laminating things. <laughs> Uh, but next up we have the wood bee. And this has a hook on the back so you can hang it up. I didn't take any of the tags off yet in case they said anything. But I think this is super cute. And again, this can go in any room. It can be styled in many ways. 
So they have it in a like on a shelf in the kitchen in the bathroom. And it looks cute in all of them. And it coordinates with that pillow if you want it to. Like subtle coordinations. I like that. I don't like when everything's like matchy matchy, but like subtle like that. Like this can be in one room and then you walk in the other and see the pillow. Like, you know, certain people might catch on to there. Maybe you don't catch on to it, but your mind portrays it as like cute. <laughs> but I think this is cute for sure. And I like the color of what it is too. Can you even see it? I don't know. We're going to hang that somewhere for sure. Next up, we have the wall ledge. I have been like eyeing shelves like this, or is it a ledge, a shelf? I, I guess it is. You know. Oh! Oh no, don't be destructive. But I've been wanting these like hanging shelf type things. So we have a wall ledge here painted white. Uh, and this is so cute. So they show this in the bathroom, like holding some like soap and stuff. I'll show you in a second, like in an office. Like this will free up space and display stuff. Like I have a lot of empty wall space where I live. I like switch it up pretty often, like what artwork I have up and stuff. But there's still like a lot of wall space. And I was thinking like this would be perfect to display like the smaller things I have. Because um, I have high ceilings. But again, I'm moving in a few months or whenever I do. I don't know yet. Um, but a few months or less at a time. So I'll get to style this twice and I'll tell you like how I'll show you uh, in just a bit. And then there, you can hang it there or use those to help. So it would be like this. Yeah. And so things won't fall off because it has this little here thing here. <gasps> nice. And it's too small for my cats. So <laughs> I hope they don't try and jump up. And I am so sweaty, I apologize if you can tell. Next, I'm super cute. We have a basket. It's called the Boho Basket, and it has that beautiful like blue. <gasps> I love it so much. It's a good size, too. You can fit this. <laughs> I'm going to keep saying this. In every room. Like, you can even use it, like, as, like, a toilet paper holder in your bathroom. It's, like, that small. Like, it could fit by the side, maybe, depending on your space. Oh, like, anywhere. Like, oh, my God, I love it. And I love having stuff like this. I have baskets now like everywhere, but they're not like as cute as this. I got them at like Walmart for cheap, but they're like functional because I get so much stuff from YouTube. I like to like, instead of just have a huge clutter mess, I like to have like multiple clutter messes, but in cute baskets. So I'll like have stuff to give away in one basket. I'll have stuff to put in my bathroom, one to like put downstairs. So you can use it like that way. Uh, so they show it in like an entryway. Oh, that looks really cute with a snake plant in it and in the laundry room or bathroom, I can't tell. Uh, oh, one's holding like sunscreen and stuff. I'm sorry if you can't tell. But. And they're gonna be linked down below, so I'm sure they, ha they have a blog, yeah, so you could see what they put or join those Facebook groups if you wanna subscribe, which I think you should, this is so fun. I love that they show different tips and I like seeing it with other pieces. You can see like the pillow in this one, the bee, the ledge, but this is super cute. I think I had something on here. Let's see. Handcrafted. I'm one of a kind. I was handcrafted by a master artisan. Therefore I would have, I will have subtle variations and blemishes. Well, I don't, it says, please don't think any less of me. I don't think any less of you. I love you. Just the way you are. Blemishes and all. Oh, I, I've been there. I have some too. I love this so much. Very functional. I feel like everyone could, could use them. Like, all these items. <laughs> oh, we have a few to go. I'm so happy right now. <laughs> so next, uh, this is so cute. I'm so excited to have this. A table clock. This can help me stay on track too. So you just need a double A battery, I think it says. Yeah. yeah, one double A battery. Not included, you can put in the back there, but... It doesn't even look like something that would require a battery, if you know what I mean. Like, I just love the look of it. It looks like you can remove it, too, if you wanted to. So this is called the table clock. Who said clocks are out of style? I never thought so. It just reminded me of S-Town, that podcast I listened to when I drove down to Florida when I moved my car, like, with my car. Oh, my God, that was a good podcast. Do you guys know what I'm talking about? Do you guys listen to S-Town? <laughs> oh, and if you did, is there any podcast that's come out since? Because I haven't listened to a podcast like that in a while. Is there one like it? Because I, I want to get back on that train. That was so good. Um, but back to Deca Created and clocks. <laughs> the faux leather hanger in black finish turns a seemingly ordinary clock into a functional yet stylish accent. Yeah. See, I would, I'm not good with like stuff like that, but like, yeah, I have an eye. Like, they have an eye. 
finding something like this so simple that could be put into so many different rooms and stuff or different styles of people like that's a craft like fitting in multiple styles yeah and they show different styles like oh i like it in the room there's like a yellow accent in there. Oh, oh my god i want yellow in my new place i need to get working make some money so i can decorate more but i don't have to because i have pieces here and the yellow in the pill oh, this is so perfect because if i had bought all this stuff myself it would be for sure more than 79 dollars right uh, the wood arc is next. I think this is super cute too. I love the wood. I'm like really into that. Wood and blues and yellows. Yes. <laughs> so the wood arc. And again, they show this in multiple rooms. I love it. And I think the other items they show in the photos come from their store or from past boxes. That's so nice. So if you have these too, um, you can get ideas on how to switch up your place. And I think this box is a great, like... A motivator to like switch up your style in your house every season which I think could be uplifting with your mood like exciting like you know just have a different scenery fresh pretty uh, super cool and that was everything you guys oh my god where am I gonna put this oh my god you could hang it or just place it against something like I was oh my god it kind of reminds me like of church, like Catholic school girl days but like I don't know just because it's arc I don't know but I think it's so cute and I'm I'm blocking it I'm sorry back I loved it you guys I love everything what's my favorite the pillow the basket are probably gonna be what I use like the most I like every I like every single item I love when that happens like I'm thrilled about every single item even if I wasn't moving like I'm still be thrilled because like we I'm still in a place now and I'm still going to decorate it. So um, let me quickly show you what is left in this. So they talk about their shop. It's called the Deco Shop. It's for members only. I think I said that earlier. Start building your new home with Decorated. Our members only shop features over 200 decor items to complement any style. Ooh, they have planters. They look really cute. Ooh, yes. I, I'm propagating a plant right now for kind of the first time. I hope it works because it's... I won't get into it, but I like plants. <laughs> plants. <laughs> uh, and then they talk about their add-on boxes. So they have like a Christmas one, Halloween, Easter, and right now I believe yeah, it is the new Americana box. So it's like July 4th inspired. And then they have their blog for inspiration and Deco TV. And then it says meet the team, four women they have listed there. They are awesome. Deco hacks is a hashtag you can look up and they have a referral program. So if you guys join, you can get some credit. Uh, I loved it so much, so much. Uh, so let's go into what I'm talking about or mentioned earlier about like something I'm adding to the channel. I think this is a good way. So some feedback I got in the survey is that people missed when I did more reviews of products and I agree. I love reviewing products. I love chatting with you guys. You can probably tell it. Like some people like when I talk a lot to you guys, some people really don't. <laughs> but um, so the guy, an idea I had, a shower idea, to kind of um, get reviews in but not do like full dedicated chatty videos I guess. Um, I'm going to do, I think I'm going to call it like Kit Kat break. So I'm going to have like kind of like an interruption like of some pre-filled content of me. Um, I could be doing like a mini unboxing like we'll do um, in just a moment or a review of a product. I could like just jump on and be like here's my current skincare routine or like something like that. So just like little mini reviews and they'll just be like an extra portion of the videos like uh, I think it'll be fun and I would love to know what you guys want to see. I'm thinking of, about putting like a suggestion box like on uh, like a link I can leave in the description or somewhere like uh, so you guys can let me know like what I've tried in the past you really want to review on or what you would like even if you don't know if I have it or not I can look into it. Uh, if you want to see my skincare routine or you know anything like that. Uh, if you want to see my place. So there's be like little things I can add in and get that to you and I think it'd be really fun. Uh, so I think I'm going to pre-record those like I said. Uh, I keep saying like I said, sorry. <laughs> and uh, so I'll just jump in and I think I'm going to have a little uniform for when I do that because I just got my first kitty's merch I know. Uh, and I'm super excited. You can tell I designed this like for myself and at first I was like oh god that's totally for me. But I'm like shouldn't my merch be like me though? Uh, I'm super excited. So there's a moon and stars on it and it says kitty's box. <laughs> I kind of felt annoying like putting my name on things but it's really small I can't even tell and I think it's cute. 
I wonder if I should like put the moon a little bit higher. I don't know, but uh, it seems like really good quality. I just got it. I haven't tried it on yet because I had to put on this dress. I love it. Uh, but yeah, I'll just like film some stuff. Maybe you guys tonight. So I can film it whenever and just pop it in uh, and be wearing my merch or something. <laughs> Which I'll link my merch down below. Thank you if you guys do purchase anything. It goes right back to our channel. Uh, I love it. <laughs> and there's some stuff that doesn't have moons on it. Like, like that fit kitty's boxes like the logo and stuff uh but now let's move into our kit kat break of the day so it won't always be at the end of the video like i think it'd be fun to surprise you guys like at certain parts like i have like in my mind like breaking news like i don't know like i can't do that sound maybe i can insert it somehow but probably not because I can't do too much editing with this video being up so late <laughs> or filming so late uh but I was super excited to tell you guys about this, but I didn't know how to include it into a video. So this kind of like goes with decorated because it's for your home, but not decorations. But a lot of the things I'll talk about won't have anything to do with the video, I don't think. Unless you guys want uh, that to be like something on par with or like similar theme, let me know. But I've actually tried this before. I got it first in my Grove Collaborative. I, I paid for it and I loved it. First I doubted it. Uh, but then they reached out to me and sent me one, and what I'm talking about is by E-Cloth. And this is for cleaning, and I've already mentioned it probably at least once in this video, because I mentioned it all the time, but I'm cleaning a lot, because I realized way too old that I was living my life secretly, or unknowingly, disgustingly. Like, I never deep cleaned anything. Like, so I just, yeah. I've opened my eyes a lot this year. Like, a, to, a lot. <laughs> like, um, growing as a human, finally an adult, kind of, maybe. Um, and yeah, so I'm into cleaning and I've been looking into what's best. I don't like using really harsh chemicals. And if you're like that, especially like in the kitchen, like where food is and stuff, e-cloth is amazing. And right now, I, they didn't even tell me this. I just looked on their website. There's a 50% overstock sale and I already have several things in my cart, but this is the <laughs> kitchen cleaning two cloths. So you just add water with these cloths. And I was like, no way. There's no way I'm not going to want to go in with my like beloved vinegar. I like go through vinegar way too fast. Um, I'm slowing it down though because this so you can not only clean efficiently like this thing is great. We'll get into the details. <laughs> I'm so scared of it. <laughs> it works so well. and You don't need to buy anything in addition because it works just with water. All of their products and they have so much like I'll talk about this and then I'll talk about what I want because um, I'm getting ahead of myself because I looked at it right before filming. I was like oh, I need it all. Uh, so this e-cloth just add water and it removes 99% of bacteria. So it's a microfiber cloth, and then it also comes with like a, a glass cloth, I think you'd call it. So kitchen cleaning two cloths, but you can use it in other rooms. I think my other one, the dirty wear one, like uh, that I've been using for the past two months or so, is in my bathroom, and it works. Of course, it works anywhere, but I'm just letting you know, this is designed for the kitchen. So here is what it looks like. And then there's this little scrubber end, which is so good. Like, at first I was like, oh, I want the scrubber to be bigger. You don't need it. This is a really efficient scrubber and you can put your fingers under or whatever. And then it comes with this big cloth. And I never used to do this. Like, after I wiped down my counters, then go in with this. And they're, like, extra shiny and nice. And they're not, like, they dry faster. So let's read more about it. So one cloth cleans and has a scrubbing packet to remove stuck-on residues and other finishes and the other finishes surfaces to a brilliant streak-free streak -free finish. I need a sip of water. Talking so much today, and I don't even know if I had much. Mm. So easy, cleans with just water. Efficient, removes over 99% of bacteria. Effective, gets rid of thick grease and dirt. Uh, so it's environmentally friendly, requires no chemicals, which I know a lot of people that's important too. Uh, extra large, so more cleaning, less rinsing. So you get, we already talked about that. It's excellent on hard all hard kitchen surfaces so it's perfect for sinks cooking like stove tops uh, ovens and worktops and the scrubbing packet helps remove harder food residues and dirt it really works too it's good uh, and you can use the glass cloth like you know on actual windows and stuff too so you use wet and wring the kitchen cloth wipe the surface and then polish it it's so quick and easy which is huge because like I need to time savers. I'm working on my time like that. It's seriously great. I'm so excited to get their other stuff too. Uh, so yeah, remove stubborn food residue. It, so the cloths are different. Like their microfiber cloths in general are great for cleaning, uh, but these are different because they have like more like here, I'll read what they say. They'll explain it better. So they're like premium microfibers. Uh, these cloths contain 3.1 million per square inch split on microscopic level. Like, so they're like really a bunch of little 
tears or whatever that sweep up in and get that yucky bacteria and grime and all that stuff. So they break apart and grab grease, dirt, and bacteria and remove it from surfaces. Yeah, so it's just designed in a way to be more efficient. And you don't even pay that much more. I think the one pack I got in Grove, I don't know, I don't, but they're like $11 or something like that. But now that you can get like a starter kit, so all the things are on sale are like kits it seems like for the most part, uh, the 50% off sale, and it's like, you can get five towels for like $11 or something, but it's in, it's like $14 or less to get this two pack and it lasts so long. It says here a three year promise. So you can wash these cloths 300 times at up to 90 degrees Celsius with regular washing. They last up to three years. And the way you wash these is just like how you would or should wash microfiber towels. So pretty much like normal cycle, but you don't want to use any fabric softener or any of those like, uh, dryer sheets, uh, but if you accidentally do, which I've done many times with like microfiber stuff, you can just wash it again and it'll like get its like consistency, its power back. <laughs> but I've been wanting to tell you guys about this before they even sent me one. I didn't know what they were sending me, so I was like, oh, I hope they like send me something else I could dry, but I don't even care because you can use these in any other room. Um, whoa. So it gives you some more information, which I like. So e-cloth plus you plus one year equals 4.3 million breaths free from toxic chemical cleaners. You can save 181 pounds or euros. I think it's pounds we put here <laughs> on disposable cleaning products, 3,000 sheets of paper towels saved from the landfill. That's awesome. Since I cut out paper towels, uh, this has really helped with that too, like to continue doing that. And it saved over 1,000 liters of polluted water from waterways. And this is based on a three-bedroom UK household. So it's like a big household, too. Uh, so they're based on UK. I didn't know that till now. Yeah, so... Oh, it even gives more oh, information. I love that. More tips on using it. Uh, caring for your e-cloth. So daily, just rinse and wring it out. And then weekly, you machine wash it, like I said. Tumble drain, oh, I didn't tell you this, tumble or hang dry. I think I put mine in the dryer before and it was okay. Oops. Oh, wait, it says tumble. Never mind. I thought, I just wrote hang dry. I was like, shoot. <laughs> uh, and as often as you like, you can sanitize and degrease it with boiling it in water. And then, yeah, it says for, we have different cloths for different needs. They even have stuff for pets, like pet grooming and for pet bowls. And it, I just clean my cat fountain I do it like pretty often but it is like a pain in the butt to clean like grind like a slimy stuff in it and so oh I feel bad but I have to keep on top of that so they have that um and then they have like microfiber like uh like floor tools to clean that and like dusters and they have stuff for stainless steel I saw uh bathroom specific ones all different types of stuff and I'm like yes like who would have thought like a year ago I would get so excited about cleaning products and like home stuff <gasps> look at me <laughs> oh and look at Emmy, my cute little baby girl look at all our new stuff in perfect timing our camera is flashing red we talk so much our battery died do i talk too much because i get excited yeah you guys can't even see her i must see emmy oh yes so cute so emmy say bye i don't know why i do that she doesn't even meow much she's so quiet and precious Anyways, thank you guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Uh, and everything will be linked down below. Thank you for filling out the survey if you did already or if you plan to. And uh, again, welcome if you are new. I hope you stick around. Uh, and I hope you have a positive, safe, healthy weekend. I love you so much. And I will see you super soon. Bye, guys.